so it is not going to be. Hi, what you doing? You trying to get out of the room? Okay, get out. Go, go, go. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a Fabletics haul, try on, and kind of review. I've been a Fabletics VIP member for four years now, almost five years. So all of these products were bought last week, so during the second week of September, Amazon Prime Day was having their Prime Day sales and knowing that a lot of other brands were trying to compete with Amazon and figuring that you know, people are going to have money to spend, they're going to spend it on Amazon, we might as well have our own sales so that they have that money to spend on us instead of spending it all at Amazon. So they had something called a cyber preview sale. Now that was a 40% off. Now me being a member, I'm going to include all of the prices on here and all the sizes that I got. I want to be completely transparent with you guys and show you what I got at what price. Now starting off, we have the fighter outfit. This is the Daria Jogger, the Piper Seamless Bralette, and then also the Monica Cinch Pullover. I'm going to put that on in a second. I just wanted to show you what the bra looks like on its own. So this is the Daria Jogger in a size large or a size 10. Um, typically, I wear a size 8 in pants, but I wanted a little bit of a looser feel, especially for comfy joggers at home. It's super duper soft, super lightweight and comfy, so I would say this is a great, like, summer or if your house is still quite warm in the winter i would do these joggers they're very lightweight very super soft and then this bra it is a halter style bra very low impact i definitely would not wear this for a high intensity workout um it does not have padding which i do have to warn you if it is cold outside or you have sensitive areas here you are you may have a nip slip <laughs> um it is no padding and it's a light color so very likely your nipple area could pop out potentially um i either recommend wearing a one of those sticky bras underneath or you can just wear like um those nipple covers or um if you can just slip a little removable cup underneath if you're not going to be moving around a lot and you're just wearing it for style and then this is the third piece so this is the Monica cinched pullover. So it's called the cinch pullover because it has these strings on the side that you can pull it tighter. So this is what it looks like completely uncinched. So if you just want it loose and comfy and you know, maybe even like a PJ set, you wear it like this. It's a little bit tighter on the ends. So if you wanted to like kind of raise it up a little bit, super cute. Now, uh, how I would like to wear it is I'm going to pull the tabs on the side and on the other side, pull this side so that it almost becomes a crop top, but like a loose, nice, flattering crop top. So if you look at that, it has a nice little loose look here and it's super flattering, makes your waist look smaller. And then you have that bra underneath. But if you look at that now, you just have a super cute, flowy, comfy, two-piece set and depending on how much you want to show you can just bring it down a little bit and then this looks like almost like a jumpsuit super cute super comfy so soft highly recommend and i'm not sure if it's still going on but it was 10 percent of the proceeds were going to the breast cancer foundation so that's great because it's october pink set you know help out breast cancer support so next outfit now these next two pieces are not an outfit. I bought them separately. And so this is the Kinsley Crop Seamless Long Sleeve. It's a super flattering square neck top. It also is very super soft. Um, it's quite thick, so I would say it's pretty warm. Once again, does not have any padding in it. Um, I would warn the same thing that you may either want to wear a sticky bra underneath or a sports bra the only thing is the reason i didn't wear one is because this neckline is so gorgeous i didn't want to have ugly straps distracting away from this beautiful neckline so you may want to wear nipple covers or uh, removable cups just you may have a nip slip if it's cold 
Now, these pants are the Blaine joggers, um, or Blaine harem pants, harem joggers. So that means this waistband is going to be extra large here and or like just very wide this is a size large like i said i'm typically a size medium i just like to wear my joggers in a size large or extra large just to have that extra flowiness plus they're harem pants so they're going to be wider and more flowy as is as you can see super flattering super comfy unfortunately it's not an outfit set so i did have to buy them individually which made them a little more pricey but each one of these did come in their own outfits i just didn't like the matches and didn't think it was worth it to me so this next outfit is also individual pieces they are not an outfit set this is the mila midi sports bra and then the blaine harem pant as you've already seen but in almond dust instead of the coffee color so these pants are in an extra large um as you can see the crotch is quite low on me unfortunately with fabletics sizes do sell out so if you don't act quickly which as i was checking out both medium and large sold out so i had no choice but to get the extra large honestly they're comfy and they're big and they're very harem style they're a little too big i may check to see if in store they have the large size available so I could just make an exchange because honestly these are a little too big and then this bra super comfy I can range anywhere between a small and a medium in the bras but in this case when it's the midi style and it has the extra support here I like to size up because this can tend to be very compressive and a little uncomfortable if I, it's too tight this one's really cute too it does have a pocket in the back you can put your phone into and it's really really good support and then also i know the set this one came in a set with a legging in the same print however since i bought it during a sale when it was first released the set already sold out so one of the negative things i would have to say about fabletics is that the they don't really restock quick enough and the moment a style sells out they don't restock it very often unless it's like a classic like black legging and so they leave the pieces that like one half of the, the set that doesn't sell well to sell on its own. So I still liked this print and I thought this would still look really cute with a black legging. So I still brought the top even though the legging sold out. Normally I like to match my sets, but yes, unfortunately I wasn't able to get the bottoms. Now this final set, believe it or not, is not an outfit set, which really, really pissed me off when I was buying it. You would think that the same color bra and the same color pant and they advertise it in the pictures together would be an outfit set on the website but actually it's not unfortunately so this is the mila midi uh, medium support bra same was the tie-dye one you saw earlier in a nude color and then these are the mila leggings or the mila capris and it's called i think cafe ole is the color now how i feel about this color on my skin tone I haven't quite decided. It's a little too on the dot to my skin tone and I feel like I'm wearing spandex or like Spanx just to make myself look thinner because it's the exact same color as my skin tone. This is one of my favorite pairs of capris and leggings that they have because it is it has pockets, it's their power hold material, it's really really flattering and it just has great compression. This is a medium, as I've stated before, I'm typically a medium in their leggings. And then this bra also has the pocket in the back as the other one does as well. I haven't quite decided if I like it or not. Part of me likes it and part of me hates it. So I haven't quite decided. Um, yeah, it's, it's comfy and it fits right. I'm not in my tip top shape right now, but as you can see, it still fits pretty well and I don't know. I just feel like from far away, someone's going to be like, is she wearing any clothes? But the nude trend's very in right now. It just happens that my skin tone is really pretty much the same. So I have one more piece to show you and I'm going to put it right on top of this. So this is the Halle cropped hoodie. Super duper lightweight, like really, really lightweight. So this is definitely not a keep you warm kind of jacket. Ignore the tag. Like I said, these are all just fresh out of the packaging. It is a little zipper hoodie, super cute, 
super flattering. This is in a size medium. It is a little cropped, so as you can see, it's just above my belly button. It's a white sheer material with a pink detailing. Really cute. I will be keeping this one. I don't know. I feel like the nude set's growing on me more and more, but I don't know. For the hell of it, I wanted to show you guys all of the Fabletics I own. I'm not going to lie, it's excessive. So I used to work for the company uh, as a retail sales associate in store. And so I knew, well, I also got a free outfit every month as an employee and kind of knew the tricks to making sure I got the best deal possible. Obviously, it's it's still fair to the company. It wasn't really a trick. I just knew when to buy. I never really bought anything at full price and um, kind of just became obsessed with wearing workout clothes in a cute set. It was during my time that I was losing a lot of weight. And so wearing a cute outfit at the gym and knowing that I looked good motivated me to work out that much harder. So it became an obsession and honestly I bought way too much. I'm still buying way too much and it's kind of a never ending obsession unfortunately. I'm just hoping that eventually I can drop those sizes even more but right now I'm going to show you my sports bra collection. So all of these drawers down here in the lower section of my closet are all sports bras. So this drawer here is going to be all of my pink and burgundy. There's probably about 10 sports bras in here. And keep in mind, my laundry basket is very full, so there's plenty of things missing from these drawers as well. And then we have our yellow one with a little bit of brighter reds and um, neon colors. I have this larger drawer down here full of white sports bras. I have at least 20. And then right here I have my blues and I believe purples in here and also like sea colors. And then here are all black sports bras. I have to have at least 30 in here. And then also down here are all of my black leggings. So I keep my black leggings separate from everything else just because they are a staple to wear. So I just wanted to have them a little bit separate from everything else. And now I'm going to show you my legging collection in my drawers on this side. This also isn't everything, like I said, I have stuff in the laundry basket right now, but just to give you an idea of how excessive it is. So here in this drawer is going to be my Motion 365 Trinity legging pockets with pockets here on this side. Up to here is also more leggings with pockets. Here we start more patterns and colorful leggings here as well, and these are all high-waisted. Moving on, we have this other drawer. These are going to be more of the Power Hold series, and these are also with pockets. These are all the Mila Capris that you saw me wearing earlier. These are going to be Power Hold 7 8 and full-length leggings, and this is just some of the excessiveness. Keep in mind, some are missing. Hey guys, it's Trina from the future. I'm editing this right now, and I realize I did not even end it. Um, basically I just showed you everything I have that is Fabletics and I am a huge advocate of the brand. I love their product. I swear this is not a sponsored video and I am a true advocate of the, of the product. Fabletics, if you want me to be an ambassador, I'll gladly be one. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. If you want me to do a full video explaining the membership and how it works and my little tips and tricks of how to use it or anything like that just let me know i would love to do a video for you like that if you like these kind of haul videos let me know um just like comment and subscribe and comment down below what you would like to see me do next thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one